Uh, Clare 2 2 draw today in the SWPL Cup. Can I get your thoughts on the game first? So, obviously, first half we were the better side. Um, we obviously created more opportunities, obviously, missed penalties. Should I obviously went with that one, but obviously, a couple more. But overall, I thought the first half we were the better team, deserved to go in the lead. Second half, we just did not manage the game well at all. As soon as they get the sending off, we should have managed that obviously a lot better, and we didn't, and we shot ourselves in the foot. I do think, though, the sort of the penalty that they got is very soft, and she has bought it. But at the end of the day, like the referee's got to make a decision there. But overall, I'm quite disappointed what we we had draw considering we went in in the lead two nothing up. But just got to take it as it comes, I suppose. Points better than no points at the end of the day. Yeah, you mentioned obviously fast start, those two penalties coming earlier on. Um, you took one of them, unfortunately it wasn't to me. Um, what was the conversation that saw the penalty change? Or? Well, Suzanne had said to me originally, take the, like, the first penalty, but I was like, no, nah, it's okay, you go with it. And I thought, well, one nothing up, it gives me a wee bit of breathing space if I do, but Lauren McGregor, she knows how to get in my head, and unfortunately on the day she did. But I will say the, the wind carried it over just a little bit. Just a wee bit. Yeah. You did manage to get it, of course, you know, after that, to be the first 2-2 and up going into the, the break uh, yeah. in the lead. How did you feel at half-time? Yeah, so obviously I thought, great, we're in 2-0 two, two up, like, positives, like, obviously we're the better side. Just come out and manage the game, but as I say, second half we just shot ourselves in the foot, we did not manage it well at all. Yeah, but you disappointed, obviously, come on, it went down to 10 men. It didn't really feel like you had a lot of chances after that attack. No, we didn't, but I also did. I don't know, I'll need to watch it back, but I don't know if my one that I scored the third has been offside. I'll need to watch it back, but it was very late in putting his flag up anyway. So, But other, we didn't create enough chances, like we should have, having them down to, as I say, 10 men. That's against the wall, but fair play to Kermanic, they came out and they defended and they kept themselves going. And they had a few opportunities to go go ahead as well, so just have to take it as is, I suppose. Four points from the first two SWPL Cup games, it means that your last match against Motherwell is uh, probably decides, well, well decided who's going to finish off the group, are you looking forward to that? Yeah, it should be a good test, obviously they're a league above us, um, so it should be a good test. Um, obviously, like today is, I, do, I am disappointed, but I do feel like, well obviously we go out, we start against Motherwell, we did against Kelly today, the way we did against Glasgow City, Glasgow Girls, sorry, last week, we came out fast start, so just need to take that to next week, we have a good week of training and just go for it next week, all guns blazing and see how we go. And obviously, new side for you this season, moving from Kermanic to Bath, so how are you enjoying it? Yeah, it's good, it's obviously I'm enjoying the change, um, obviously to be fair the squad is fairly new, there's, I think there's only a handful of girls that are ones that were there last season, so we are still building as a team as well, so it will take time, um, but I'm, I'm really enjoying it, yeah, it's good.